Hello guys, welcome back to Cosport Sam Empire. I'm bringing guys with another brand new video. Um, this video is not meant for all of you, uh, the normal subscribers. This video is meant to gain followers uh, out of the popularity of YouTube so that you can get more subscribers. So guys, if you're interested in learning about Ruby's Cube, um, this is a tutorial and I hope uh, it actually helps you out. So anyways, let's get straight in it. So guys, the first step that you need to actually know, this is the basic, that's uh, white is always opposite of yellow, orange is always opposite of red, uh, blue is always opposite of green. And uh, as you continue into the video, if you want to pause or reverse back to watch some of the steps that you missed, um, you can do so, feel, feel free. Um, anyways, let me scramble the cube up and uh, then get it a really, really good scramble. First step first, uh, I think this is a really really good scramble. First step first is you want to face the white side, the white side to face up. Uh, just as you can see right here, I mean it's going to face any direction. Keep in mind that orange is always opposite of red, uh, green is always opposite of blue, and uh, yellow is always opposite of, yellow, of white. So the first step that you need to do is actually solve the cross. In solving cross, not just solve it, uh, you're supposed to solve it in accordance to the colors. Just like here, it's supposed to be white and blue. Here, it's supposed to be white and red. Here, it's supposed to be white and green. And here, it's supposed to be white and orange. The cross is supposed to look just like this. Um, you, you can get different circumstances. Just for example, um, I show you one of the circumstances. Um, you have this white and orange and you want to bring it up here. Um, I'm going to teach you on, on my method that I normally use and I teach everyone who wants to learn uh, from me. Uh, it's called the lift. Um, this one wants to climb up here. So this is the lift and this is the person. The person has to get out of the way of the elevator. The elevator to come down and then the person to enter the elevator and then the elevator can go up. So um, you can get other circumstances just like um, one of these, one of these actually you have to face the white and then after facing the white you're supposed to bring it in where it's supposed to go. Just for example, you have been given something like this. So you just face the white, no matter how it is, no matter where, where, where the white is, maybe the white is here, then the green is here. So you face the white and then you move it in such a way that when when this one enters it enters it into the right slot so the most appropriate slot is right here and that is uh, for the cross let's get to the corners so guys the corners is is a really really great process and it is really really simple uh, the corners just solve uh, these corner cubes in such a way that this is white uh, this is blue over here and this is orange in just their respective uh, columns just for example here it's supposed to be white orange green it's supposed to be white green red it's supposed to be white red and blue and anyways um let me show you some circumstances um this is a cube this is white red white blue and red and this one is supposed to go right here so first of all you're gonna bring it where it's supposed to go directly down anyways um just uh, as i show you in in the in the elevator form uh, this is an elevator and this person needs to go up to up here So the person has to get out of the way of the elevator the elevator to come down the person to climb and the elevator to go up um, Let's let's complete it and then uh, we move on to the next step So guys just for example, um, there is a cube just like this one white uh, blue uh, orange white this one needs to enter right here but as I told you the white is supposed to face to face on the side so that you can bring it up uh, normally using the elevator method but this on the white is facing down so actually what you need to do in this method is actually not to move it away so that the elevator can climb down and uh, and the person to climb the elevator so that the elevator can climb up because it's gonna be opposite so what you need to actually do right here you need to actually press the person through the elevator so the person can actually move to the side and then now you move the side the person out of the elevator and then just climb the elevator up and so now it's correct so now you can just insert it easily as you can see so guys after solving the white layer uh step by step grows fast and then the corners now you move to the second layer see the first layer is completely solved 
now we move to the second layer the second layer is only four cubes which is really really simple this one this one over here this one over here and this one over here so it's just four steps just for example i need this cube this cube might be anywhere might be here 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 or or in the rest of the cube um anyways uh for example i want to insert this cube over here so first of all you match it to the respective colors for example this was green you match it with green this was orange or you match it with orange now orange being here and green being there i use the same same method of elevator you meet this is green you move it away from the elevator which was green and then you bring the elevator and then the person climbs in and then the elevator goes down as you can see now it is much and now you can just insert it easily moving it out of the way elevator climbing down so that the person can enter and then the elevator climbs up and then you just do it for the rest of this um, another circumstance that you can get is uh for example this is blue and red i showed you that when 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 it is up here you just match it with their respective colors but right now there's no it's nowhere near it it's actually inside but it is uh inverted so what you actually need to do is to bring this cube to where it's it's supposed to be where they where, where is the yellow side and then you bring it back um again which will be correct so you just assume any any cube right here I just assume any cube just for example i say this is red and this is blue so blue is away from is our is this direction so i move it away from blue and then i bring the elevator and then the person climbs in and then the elevator goes down and then you simply insert it in the normal way this is supposed to go here so you need to get the person away from the elevator the elevator comes down the person gets in and then the elevator comes up and as you can see the cube right now that i wanted to insert the assumed one is actually inside and then the one that we are supposed to insert here is outside so um you simply insert is easily blue is supposed to be this side so move it away from blue bring the elevator up and then the person enters and then and then it matches just like that and then this one can insert it easily right here as uh then for example this one this one also you can just to use the same method um just assume any cube just for example i say this is orange and this is blue so blue is this side so move it away from blue bring the elevator up and then you, you return this one and then return the other one and then you simply insert it right here which is simple and as you can see now the cube is actually up here and then now you can simply insert it again which is really really simple and now we're moving to the third layer third layer we're supposed to solve the cross first that is the first step as we did on the bottom so solving the cross you can get different circumstances just like uh just like this one dot over here or the cross that just happened or you can get we can get an l uh, if you get an l uh it's supposed to face top left so remember that top left if it is uh if it is a straight line it's supposed to face the uh, vertical uh horizontal i mean and then if it's a dot you can just do it anywhere uh so the step goes this way f r t r1 t1 f1 and uh as you can see now the cruise comes if it is an l uh, it will go to a straight line and then straight line it will go to a solved uh, cross moving to the next step is supposed to solve the corners corners which are supposed to be yellow 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 you can get different circumstances uh, for example this is two yellows if you get two yellows don't concentrate on the upside concentrate on the other two cubes now you just find a cube on the left side on the left side that is facing you as you see this cube is not facing me this is facing me so uh if you get two of the cubes and then now look for one is which is facing you if you don't get any yellow over here you just look for a cube on the left side which is facing away and then perform the following method and then if you get just get one yellow as uh, just for example well, well, let, let me do the method when you get two you you just look at one which is facing you and then put it on the left side and then perform this method right t right prime t right double t and then you simply return this back and then now you get one this one will lead you up to the last step uh when you get one you just put it on the top uh, on the left side don't go on the other ones on the other ones for example you get two you just look for one which is facing you and then if you don't get any other you just look for one which is facing away um anyways we already got one over here so we'll just continue r 
tr1 tr double t and then return it and then now you got uh, also another yellow don't be confused just continue the method until you finish the cube so you simply bring it back to the left side and then you continue the method right t right one t right double t then we return and now as you can see the white is completely solved uh, the yellow i mean it's completely solved um anyways let me take a break and then i continue so guys after solving the yellow layer um we'll go to the next step this step is called headlights headlights means uh, for example this is blue this is supposed to be blue this is green this is supposed to be green this is red this is supposed to be red um let me show you uh without confusing you um just for example i do this i do this i mean uh now this is what they call headlights this is green this is green this is red this is red this is blue this is blue now that is what you call headlights um let me show you something um just for example this is uh, what you had last time so uh as you can see right here i only have one headlights which is uh the blue side we're just gonna match it to the blue side and then we let it face away and then you perform the following moves uh, while it is away remember that uh, r prime f r prime double back and then r r and then uh, f prime and then r r prime i mean uh, if i'm confusing you you can just check uh, this this description right here it's gonna show you the methods carefully and then do a double back and then a double right which will make you gain one uh i mean all of them if you if you if you had none it will make you gain one and then after one it will make you gain all of them and now as you can see we have we have full headlights green green orange orange blue blue red red uh and then now you simply match the headlights in accordance to the colors as as for this one it's for blue and then now uh this there are different circumstances right here you can get such that uh, blue is is facing uh, uh, away and then it is completely solved while these three are swapped green is uh, orange is supposed to be here red is supposed to be here green is supposed to be here that means they have been swapped in this direction i mean they have been swapped in the, the, this direction that means uh, they're supposed to go in this direction in just keeping that in mind uh, in this in this description right here um you can perform these moves and then it rotates only these three uh, you perform this move double a and then the direction in which it wants to go just for example mine it wanted to go this direction and then you simply bring the middle up and then you rotate it twice and then you bring the middle down and then you move it in the direction that you want and then you simply complete it in which it will make the cube solve and then you can get a different circumstance this was circumstance just like uh this one uh one is not solved uh the method that i showed you it was just for swapping these three but this one is uh for example none of them are solved this one's supposed to go back this side's supposed this one is supposed to go here and this is supposed to go here so here you can actually perform a shop a shorter method uh this method uh is called uh is is it's one of the popular method that people actually use so it goes this way middle twice in the middle i mean and then twice chop twice middle uh try mm, one time chop and then twice middle and then one time twice uh chop and then twice middle then simply complete it or you can also do this method uh wait or you can also uh, so see the same circumstance or you can also do this the same same method that i show you into to swap three of them so you're gonna swap this blue to become here and then this blue uh you're gonna swap it to become here so as you can see this blue i want to make it come here so i'm gonna use this direction keep in mind i'm going this direction so double f the direction i need to to go and then middle up you rotate it twice and then middle down direction which you want to go and then double f now you can see the blue is right here so the blue wants to go this side the blue was right here we made it come here here and then we make it go there um so here it, need, it needs to go here so it's in this direction so double f the direction in which you need to touch to go then middle up rotate it twice uh, then you bring it down direction it wants to go and then complete it and uh, as you can see 
you completely solve the Rubik's Cube. I actually have another method. This is just a beginner's method. If you want small methods, or uh, I have even more cubes right here. It's 5x5, five five. this is 4x4, four 2x2, four, two two, Mega Mix, Mirror Cube, and then Triangle. Uh, I have plenty of them. If you guys want one of them or or, or you want to be taught actually uh you can just you can just contact me if you live in Mombasa yeah the contact whatsapp number instagram number uh i mean instagram username uh, you can just contact me then i can send you private videos on uh quickest way how to solve it anyways guys thank you so much for watching um if you're a new person watching my video don't forget to subscribe i hope this video helped you so much anyways um see you guys uh, in the next video Peace out.